Uh, so at uh, 2 12 p.m. this afternoon um, some of our officers who were down here on the walk the beat program were flagged down um, and were notified of a shooting that had occurred in the 1600 block of Champa Street. Um, the preliminary information that we have at this time is that there was an altercation involving several individuals uh, that led to shots being fired. Uh, two males were, uh, were shot and they were both transported to the hospital where one of them was pronounced deceased and the other is still receiving medical attention at this time. Um, our officers uh, flooded the area and uh, re received information that uh, two po parties who were possibly involved in the shooting had boarded an RTD bus and our officers were able to locate that bus. Um, it was stopped here in the, the 1700 block of Champa and uh, two parties were removed from that bus without incident and they were detained and they're currently being questioned. Um, we have uh, numerous witnesses that we're currently getting statements from and are working to process the scene and gather all available evidence so we can determine what happened here. Anything you can say about the nature of the conflict? No, that's, that's part of what we're still trying to determine. Um, you know, what led up to this, um, why this altercation occurred. Um, but at this time, uh, we, don't have, uh, we don't have a clear sense of what that is. Any, any information about the ages? Are these grown? men or teenagers? Yeah, at this time I, I don't have their ages. Um, I do know that our, our, our two victims are males. And one has died? Correct. One was pronounced deceased at the hospital. Uh, any danger to the public right now or do you feel like this is all Contained. At this time, we believe we, we, have, um, a two part, we have two parties detained who are our possible suspects here. Uh, work is still underway to determine uh, you know, if they are indeed our suspects in this particular case. So um, we don't believe that there is an um, immediate threat to the area at this time. Sounds like there was a huge immediate response by police. Or, uh, tell us about extra patrols that are going on right now on the mall. Sure. Walk the Beat program uh, has uh, additional officers down here in the 16th Street Mall area. Um, they were the ones who were immediately notified and uh, immediately responded to the situation. Um, other officers flooded the area as well um, and helped to quickly uh, determine the location of the bus that um, on, on which these two parties that were detained were riding. Um, and again, they were they were removed from the bus without incident and are currently being questioned. Any idea in the exchange of gunfire? How many shots were there? No, I don't know if, uh, whether or not there was an exchange of gunfire at this point or whether, uh, you know, how many shooters we have and how many shots were fired. That would all be part of the investigation. Was a gun recovered? At this point, I'm not sure if a gun has been recovered or not. I've not, not been briefed on that.